working as intended. Dang it. <laughs> wow, level 27. Yeah, so I've been doing a lot of stuff in my free time in this game, so I learned a lot. I didn't learn very much of anything. I mean, you never do. <laughs> Yellow onion! Pop, pop. So I guess the first thing we do is go around and gather our stuff. So, I've learned that you can never have enough money. I have like no. a million coins, and I still can't plant my entire plot. Okay, so if you notice uh, in our inventory, we have these things called gold nuggets. Potato level up. Go uh, fill your farm level up. So the last one that says 2 out of 30. Oh, our inventory. Uh, yep. Yeah. Those are worth, like, you can trade them in for materials or money, and they're worth about 10,000 gold each. Okay, so our Holy nuts and our moly. grapes are full. Yeah, watermelons are worth a lot. They also uh, increase in price a lot because uh, they take two days to grow. Do you want to sell while I pick these up since uh, so they don't fill up? Or overfill? Sure. Uh, the other thing is, you know these uh, things to sell stuff? I have, like, multiple of them. Also, it's not always good to sell them because you do need some of these as materials later. Yeah, it's just we're over full right now and I'm about to pick up uh, three more full 9x9 nine nine, or 3x3 three three plots. Be the fruit stand. Yeah, we have 90 for fruit though. Oh. You're talking about grapes. There's grapes, nuts. Oh, no, I think I'm looking at the meat stand. Uh, we can't get the nuts dad yet, it's level 15, I believe. The other thing I've learned is that if something has a function, it will say what the function is in the description. So if there is no function, there's nothing in the description. Okay. Later we'll be able to trade in uh, fruit for those uh, quest things. It's fifty, er, it's five hundred fruit per metal. We've traded into these uh, jam stalls ten times. So I'm not good at this game yet, but I'm slowly getting there. You want me to go fishing? Oh no, you're doing fishing. Sure. Okay. No, you go no, ahead. Go ahead. No, you, you need the experience. I'm at level 20 something. Uh, I think it gives us both the experience when anybody, anybody does anything. I guess that's true. Hey, Mike. Yeah. This is my smiling tractor. That's a combine. Whatever. But it's smiling at you. It's got happy faces. <laughs> it's happy to see you. Actually, that's not a combine, that is a swather. I mean, you're the farmer, dude. Do you have one of these? Nope. It's the equipment that you need, but not the ones that you deserve? Uh, I could use one so I can do my own hay. <laughs> that would be nice. Uh, the other thing is that, you know these trees? Uh, they, they spawn by season. So whenever the season changes is when the timer finishes, so that's how you can tell when it's going to possibly be coming up, depending on which season it is. Oh, okay. Okay, what are we full on? Grapes? We don't- do we have a grape stand? Not yet, no. And meat. Do we have a meat stand? Those are nuts. Oh. Uh, those ones you can't get until a fairly higher level. We're gonna need way more room for our things. Oh, check the trees! Man, getting shit done. Awesome. Almond trees are ready. I think uh, I think we have enough extra money. We could probably start uh, building a tree house. Oh, I got a little. Oh yeah, I got a doggo too. I just unlocked <laughs> the doggo last time. So tree house is sixty thousand gold. Uh, we have one hundred twenty-five, but I think we should use that to actually use plant this time around instead of uh, running a barely um, able. So the other thing is that in order to learn more crops you have to level it. So like we have one that requires blue grape level 8. Oh, okay. How can how how long till we are able to start rice patties? That's a good question. I don't think I've opened up rice. Nice to wheat you. This season doesn't really have much. You can't even make turnips so I guess lettuce. Okay. Yeah, we'll do the quick things, and then at the end we'll just spend everything we got on expensive stuff that when we come back next time we can just make a killing. Sort of like watermelon? Yeah. Uh, so for the animals, do you want me to downsize some of them? No, 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 because if you sell you get half of what you paid for it, so we haven't even broke even on them yet, right? But right now we're 
are doing all right. Well, the chickens will have broke even on, and the pigs. Just not the ducks that are new. We need the ducks for the quest. Right. The only time I ever make animals is when I need them for the quest. Just because they're so expensive to maintain. Yeah, I'll let the pigs run their feet out and I'll get rid of them. No, 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 keep the pig. You're going to need them for quests, too. Okay. If we don't, if we don't, if we don't, like, need them right away, we can just let their feet run out and it's fine. But we should keep the actual spots because we could need them. Because you'll actually learn, like, get the ability to get, take more than one quest at a time. You can have up to seven quests. I did my homework. Of course you did. You're Asian. Yep. I did mine in class because I didn't want to do it at home. I mean, in high school I always do all my stuff in class. Yeah. And we need we need the big gas station. The big gas station we need a lot of uh, those pink stuff. Okay. I think it's like 25. The, the ribbons? Yep. So oh, so see, the nice thing with like, you know, the melons? Watermelon? Yeah. Every level of the game, like, you get like seven or eight more because their value is high. I think I read once you uh, reach the max level of something, it increases the value of it by about 320%. Be beat, Fishing motherfucker. can be pretty good too because it's kind of just uh, leave it and. Yeah, fishing and. Uh, flowers. Like tree and flowers are nice. Uh, they do take a while to break even. I think like most trees. Whoops. <laughs> There, making such a mess. That That's plus. okay. Uh, like, all these things we can just move later, right? Now we're just being silly. Alrighty, let's see what we got here. We got was wasabi plants. Wasabi. Uh, so at the end here, that's what we should plant all over the place, is just a ton of wasabi. Time to water again. What are you doing? And our lettuce is gonna be so leveled. I'm just looking through all the new stuff we got. Did we want to plant a couple cypress trees, or just wait until we actually need them for a quest? Now wait till we actually need them. Right now we need those stupid ducks. Plant tuna. On koi. We need parasol mushrooms as well, so I guess when some of these finish. Parasol mushrooms, I believe, take an hour? Watering this shit. A milk stand. Oh, there's the nut stand. Oh, what? Do we have it already? Yeah. You should buy one. I know the stands are mostly pretty cheap. For like, what, 10 diamonds? 30 diamonds? So, you know what I don't get is that later you can get, like, vegetable truck, which lets you trade in 250 vegetables at a time instead of 20. But they give you less than if you traded in each one separately. Uh. Which is kind of annoying. I built a couple nut stands. Man, you're nuts. Alright, let's see what else we got new. Looks like good we do have trout. Yeah. We need that for a quest too. And some eels. Do we have eels? Oh, we should be. I think we built some. Those were like the second thing you built. Also, that's fine if you actually combine all the water together, it's not a big deal. Like, even though the right. fish will mingle, each spot still counts as, like, its own spot. So, like, even though you can fish anywhere in it, it'll still count as being, like, the separate ones. You can just fish them all from one spot. It's like, you I know like what? To, I like to just keep it separate. You don't want them to mingle? The only, the only ones that don't mingle is when you make piranhas. They get their own pool. Uh -huh. <laughs> Just gonna build a couple more eels and some more trout. Whoops! I just put the trout in with the salmon. Oh well. Hey, just move it. You didn't recycle it, did you? Nope. I just haven't touched them. Yeah, in my single player game, I have a gigantic pool of mixed fish. Lettuce is done. Lettuce, go farming. Our lettuce is level twelve. <laughs> What's the max level? 200. Have you hit max level in anything yet? Fuck no! I, I had to ask, cause... Oh, vegetables are full. Hang on. 
don't don't harvest anymore. Oops. You build another barn to increase. I think the barn increases the storage for this as well. Yeah, by ten. I just, another, right. I just built another vegetable stand that increases the storage for vegetables by 40. Hey Mike, you know what happens when we make more rows of these uh, areas to plant? What's that? The plot thickens. Dang it. <laughs> well there goes all my fuel. I got mine too, just about three quarters right now. Oh yeah, then there's these ones we planted in amongst the uh, animals. Quick, spend a thousand. Get some more wheat. Uh. The cow about no! These beehives are eventually also worth uh, the pink ribbons as well. Oh, okay. You, if you build 40 of them, you get two ribbons per 24 hours. Okay. Uh, pigs are out of food. Do you want me to just uh, get rid of them? No, feed them. Why not? Uh, well, yeah, I was going to take a look at the flowers and maybe expand our flower plot. Uh, I usually don't make flowers until I actually need them. It's because flowers take 20 to 30 hours to break even on them. Yeah, well that's why it's uh, best to start them whenever, right? Also, on my single player game, played on a flatland. Well, that's no fun. Should build our house right here. Increase level 25, I can build a yokan. What? A <laughs> Japanese style house. Oh, jeez. I was just playing on flatline because I like having patches of like 200 by 200 for my vegetables. Not sure if I want to build lettuce yet. I'll see what the next season holds. Single player game. I have a thing that takes 10 minutes, but it costs 2,000 to put down. Oh, jeez. Yeah, the animals get out of hand too. Like, it costs me about 200,000 in order to feed my animals now. Alrighty, let's get back to plant. Okay, so wait, wait for the season to change. See uh, what we can plant next season. But first, mm -hmm. we get the uh, get the fruit. Once the season changes, right? Okay, check all the trees. Apples. So apples pop up every season. I think you have to be like level twenty in order to get uh, the big gas thing. Turnips is like twenty profit as opposed to like fifteen from lettuce. Or I guess from lettuce it's like five if you include the price of the plot. So there's sprinklers, there's animal feeders. Animal feeders will pretty much like feed your animals till their till completion, but they take oh, extra nice. resources and the money. Like you can't, you don't have to, you don't pay just the money. You have to pay extra resources as well. So like it could be like you know three wheat per block plus the same cost. So probably not worth it. Is what you're saying. The feeders, no, the feeders are nice because they. We'll let something grow fully over, like, if you have to leave or, like, if you take off for a while. Oh, okay. But they're expensive. They're four ribbons to build one, and they only cover 12, like, plots. 12 units. Same with their sprinklers that keep two tiles watered. But they cost one pink ribbon each. I don't know if it's worth it for just two plots. I mean, it is once your ribbon, like, because later, when you do the long-term quest... And you can finish the long-term quest quickly, you can literally get like a hundred ribbons every time you log in. More turnips. Oh, jeez. What's up? All this watering. What are you doing? Everything. Don't worry, gasoline situation becomes much more manageable with a big gas station. But that's not for a while. I just watered over here. Yeah, ten minutes stuff is watered quickly. It's like, where's the rain when you want it? Whoops. <laughs> well, those plots will be ready for whenever we want to plant stuff there. <laughs> I'll, I'll just actually get rid of these plots. You can get rid of plots with your uh, tractor out. It gets rid of nine plots. All oh, right. Dingus. Ah, I'll do it the slow and dumb way. I mean, that's pretty much a great way to describe you. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I'm pretty impressed with making the, that dragon in uh, R.A.D. Yeah, I'm impressed you actually did something worthwhile. You should just be like, 
I'm gonna build this thing so it make give me like 20 iron ore or every 20 minutes. I'm just like I can make like 7,000 in five minutes here. I don't do things to get like resources. I do things for flashy explosions. You know what else you also do? What? Use up money to buy weed. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I can. You need to be able to run irrigation lines that just let you uh, irrigate entire areas. I'm moving more of the trees over here. Bring in more trees. You put down some ducks. Mm, we have nine out of twenty yeah. ducks. Yeah, there's uh, nine ducks. North of the uh, wait, uh, I actually don't know which way north, south, and whatever it is, but these are ducks. These nine plots. That's right. Okay. Keep them fed. Give me them for a quest. Oh, it's harvesting time. I'm gonna go ahead and harvest. I'm gonna keep moving some trees. Oh wait. Oh, hang on. I gotta go sell the vegetables. Right. Keep harvesting. Uh, well, I mean, we're allowed 160, so you're. Probably fine to go and get the tree yet. I'll go ahead. There's still two more here. I can sell 40 so if you, as you harvest them. So, teamwork makes the spleen work. You know, you can press tab to look at your inventory quickly, right? That's what I have been doing. I think we might have more than 160 vegetables, so I'll have to just go and sell them quickly again. We're only at 88. Now we should be close to 100. Yeah, 103. Good old cheap oriental labor. I don't think there's anything cheap about it. I kind of feel like my Japanese house should be like right here. With this little river going through it. Make a koi, koi pond nearby. Uh, now you're just being koi? Yep. 6 out of 10, that pun wasn't bad. <laughs> <laughs> Go and sell more veggies. And I'll wait to change, see, change uh, season to find out what... Uh, Go next. Keep the ducks fed. And get 20 coins from the well. We should just build a million wells. You're an idiot. <laughs> Especially since you have to go and, uh, you know, oh harvest them God. one at a time. <laughs> Can't even use the tractor. Yeah, no, you're right. It's 25. Yeah, so what sucks about the beehives, too? You have to harvest them one at a time. Should I build another beehive? Uh, beehive stuff won't be a ways away because it costs 10 ribbons to make the thing to sell the honey. I mean, it's just really slow, so. Yeah. Alright, soon there will be a change of season. And collect all the fruit again. And I'll fight to keep my tractor filled up. <laughs> Almost time to commit treason. Hmm, not many trees. Apples, though, would have grown. Apples are always grown. A mushroom stand? Yeah, to sell and mushrooms. And a flower stand. I should probably build one of each. Yep. I'll build our quest veggie. Shall I make some zucchini? It's a little less tiresome on the watering. I like the winter season. Especially when it's snowing like this. It's, it's Canada. Yeah. It hasn't snowed here much. How about you? No, uh, we've actually got quite a bit in the last uh, two, three days. Not a ton just, like we're used to, but... I want just quite a bit. He's like, oh, we just had a bit of snow, you know, like ten feet. Not... yeah, not that. <laughs> uh, probably about six, eight inches. Are we still talking about snow? Dang it. What? I guess watering doesn't work very well in winter. What did you do today? We just froze our plants. We're preserving yeah. them. Exactly. So when you harvest fish, is it like a random amount of fish you actually get? Yep. Because it's the catch chance. How long does it take for the mushrooms to grow? About an hour. Okay, so we probably won't see them. Nope. Is watering doing anything? It is not. It's actually adding time. It's not adding time. It looked like it, add, it was adding time, but I was just driving at the same time. So I s skipped over to a plant we had just planted after. 
So yeah, watering in winter is uh, dumb. Well, it depends, because the water, I think the, there's like different things in winter, because I've had it so it's not quite as white. Just like Harlem, it's not quite as white. Dang it. <laughs> uh, ducks are going to be ready in 40 seconds. Yeah! We'll get nine more ducks. And then we'll only need one more harvest after that. They should make it so there's gonna be like the land and stuff, like the water here in the way. But if you plant near the water, it should just auto water. Yeah. That's what was nice in Factory Town. If you built a uh, a factory near uh, near water that actually needed water, it would actually get it from that water source. I thought we needed the eggs, didn't we? Oh, we don't need them yet. Once the uh, house is built, you can use the eggs. Eggs, fish, vegetables, fruit can be used to build stuff. Okay, it's just harvesting the ducks we need right now. Yep. Alrighty, let's take a look and see what we should plant at the end. Oh, look, there's an animal feeder. And a honey stand. You should get the pawn shop. Hey, Mike. What? I'm not even looking what you're doing right now. I'm, uh, I just put a the... plot where you're standing. <laughs> oh. You're gonna need those when you build your house. The pagoda path. Just build watermelons again everywhere at the end. They're worth a lot, and you need level 8 to get something else. Make wonderful plots of 9. I will extend these fish out then, too. Which are these ones again? Uh, just go over them, you can see what they are. Tropical fish. Can't wait to get the big gas pump. We'll pump it up. I've just been wandering around on foot. Huh, now water's doing something. Maybe water's just less effective during winter? Come the mushrooms took off one minute. The zucchini still did nothing. Yeah, the zucchini still did nothing. <laughs> Quick, 25 gold from the well! Okay, I'm gonna get rid of these dumb plots that I made. <laughs> banana tree! Let's put banana trees, I don't know, over here. What's this one? This one's just peachy. Near coconut trees. Uh, I think you got more banana trees over here. Yeah, put them where you're... Yeah. I'll go bring some of these ones over. Dang it! <laughs> Three minutes left on the zucchinis. And I have a season change to pick up all the trees. Then plant a bunch of really long weight stuff and... And call her a day. Yep. Dang it. Did you make more plots? Yeah. <laughs> you dummy. Just gotta keep my thumb away from the space bar. Beep beep, motherfucker. I'm egging you on. Dang it. What? Your pun. What about it? I said, dang it. See, I'm egging you on. <laughs> Do you have good knowledge about chickens? It's good mm. yolk lore. Dang it. <laughs> You're so annoyed by these puns. You're a shell of your former self. Yes. Oh, they're starting. Sell the vegetables. Collect 25 from the well. New season! I think that's what a lot of people said, too, when uh, Game of Thrones was coming out. And then they were thoroughly disappointed. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, I never watched it, so... The, the, the final season. We got zero quests done today, because these are the ones that take a while. Uh, next day we should get uh, at least a duck one done. So there's like very short, short, medium, and long quests. 
There's <laughs> <laughs> all kinds of quests for all kinds of people. Yep. But I mean, the, the medium quest is worth, uh, what is it, five other ribbons? Oh, nice. So the longer they are, they're worth more. <laughs> <laughs> Leveling up that zucchini. Then we plant a billion watermelons. Of course, when I ran out of gas, it picked a really stupid pattern to the... <laughs> Teamwork. Did you get the really far away ones yet? No, I'm not even sure if I planted any out there. You did. Quick water them for an extra 13 seconds off. Totally worth it. It will be. More vegetables! Alrighty. Feed the animals. You already did I just that. did. Oh, crack trout. Something fishy here. All right, 12 out of 30 for the trout now. You plant him, I'm not even going to bother watering him. You want to grab the distance ones? Okay, I'm just uh, grabbing this uh, big plot right beside us first, and then I'll go grab them. This one here is an awkward plot. You know what who made it? Usually I'd make those awkward plots into like flowers so you don't have to keep redoing everything. Put the vendors up here. Yeah. Instead of uh, on that nice square place that we got up there. Jeez, we're gonna have uh, money left over. Mmm. I think we should put some fish or flowers in with the last bit. Oh, I'm gonna put a koi pond in. Angelfish. Where's uh, where where were you gonna put your house? Somewhere around there. I can just move it if it's in the way. Just make a nine three by three koi pond. And should I make a three by three blowfish? I don't know. Here looks fine. <laughs> yeah, we'll turn this area into all the fish. Salmon. All right, there we go. We got all this shit planted. I just built some more apple trees over here just because I can. Sell some veggies. I feel oh. like we got. A, I feel like we got a lot done today. Yeah, no quest, but uh, I, I gotta add a couple things to the uh, koi pond. Was that? Okay. <laughs> Are you done? I. I'm confused. I'm bamboozled. All right. That's us farming together. Thanks for watching. Thanks for watching, everybody. Hey, guys. If you like this video, make sure you leave a comment, like it, and share it. You can click on the left button if you want to subscribe, and the right one to watch more farm together. Thanks for watching.